guys so today's Sunday and I had an amazing day today first of all my daughter and I went to see the Nutcracker Ballet it was our first time it was spectacular we loved it she loved it I loved it we're hoping to make this kind of like a tradition so hopefully next year we'll be able to do that again um, we didn't have the best seats but now that I know the layout of the National Theater here I can pretty much get online and book our tickets and kind of pick better seats for next year hopefully <clears throat> but it was so so great so anyway this video i wanted to show you guys what i got from my husband for christmas so this is going to be a gift idea video for men and i have a dilemma so i will show you that as well so here we go all right, so this is what I got my husband for Christmas. I just put it in this gift box that I had in storage. And I also had this really pretty wrapping paper in storage as well. I'm just going to wrap this up for him in this box. I'm not going to wrap everything individually. So I got him everything I had on my gift wish list for him. And most of the stuff I got him are practical things that he actually needed. So first thing, he needs a new wallet. Um, this is, I believe this is imitation leather and it's not as big as I wanted and it doesn't have any zippers, but I think he can use this for now because he is in real need of a new wallet. So I got him this and then he's always needing deodorant and he loves the Axe deodorant spray. So I got him the Axe Dark Temptation. And then another thing that he really needs is boxers. So boxers is actually one thing he doesn't buy for himself. It's something that he needs, but he doesn't actually buy it. So every year I try to make it a point to buy him boxers for Christmas. Uh, his mom, my mother-in-law, actually got him a couple of boxers as well for Christmas. And those are wrapped in under the tree, which is awesome. But I got him a couple of boxers as well because he'll buy himself socks. He'll buy himself undershirts. But he won't buy boxers and he needed boxers so i got him those and then something fun i got him the antonio banderas the secret cologne for men i think he's gonna love this because my husband is obsessed with cologne and he likes to try out new ones so i got him that i wanted to get him his absolute favorite cologne which is the chrome He's been wearing that cologne since high school. I love it on him. It smells amazing. But that cologne, the cheapest one is like $70. And I didn't want to spend $70 on one gift for him. So I decided to go ahead and get him this one so I could also get him a bunch of other little things as well to wrap up for Christmas. So that is what he's getting for Christmas. And then I have this sort of bow here. But here's my dilemma. So, I got this for his brother, for his my brother-in-law. And I will do a separate video on what I'm getting my in-laws for Christmas. So, I can give you ideas on that. But, <clears throat> I asked him, I said, do you want to see what we're getting your brother for Christmas this year? And when I showed this to him, he said, why didn't you get me one? I want one. So, now he wants to go and get himself one of these. And I'm actually thinking if I should go ahead and switch out the cologne with this gift. This is the Blue Tone speakerphone, so you can play music uh, through Bluetooth using like a tablet or your phone, and it's portable. So I don't know if I'm going to switch this out and then give the cologne to his brother and then give him this, or if I might just keep this the way it is and then go pick up an extra one of these and add it to his gift box for Christmas. So that's my dilemma. Obviously, you'll f find out what I end up doing uh, when I do my in-law gift video. But that is pretty much what I got my husband this year for this year for Christmas. I hope you guys got some ideas, really practical gifts. And if you do stocking stuffers for any men in your lives, these make perfect stocking stuffers as well because they're small, so they fit in stockings. Anyway, if you watch this video, thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye.